Are you looking to install complimentary shaders for Minecraft 1.20.1? Well, I totally understand because complimentary shaders look awesome. In this video, I'm going to show you real quick and step by step how to get them in Minecraft 1.20.1. To get started installing complimentary shaders for Minecraft 1.20.1, Open up your browser or use the link down below in the description. Go to shaderpacks.net, search for complimentary. This will bring you to complimentary shaders right there. Just click download complimentary shaders right there and then click download 1.20.1. You'll be taken to the official CurseForge download and all you gotta do now is click download. There we go, that's the zip file we need. Drag that over to your desktop because we're gonna need it later. Now the next thing to do is to come back to this post right here, scroll down a little, and then click how to install iris shaders. You can also use Optifine, but for this video, I'm gonna be using iris shaders. So click download iris shaders, click the link at the top here, click download universal jar, there we go, you just click that right there. If you can't open this jar file for some reason, go back to this how to install iris shaders post, scroll down, click this first link to execute that program and see what it tells you. If it says you need Java, then you need this second link. Now you should all be able to open this installer. So like I said, you click the jar file, you select 1.20.1, click install, it says complete it within a second. Now what we're going to do is open up the Minecraft launcher. Once we're over here, as you can see, it's created a brand new profile for us called Iris and Sodium for 1.20.1. That's perfect. If it's not selected by default for some reason, just click this list right here and click the correct one that says Iris and then click play. It may give you this warning, so just read what it says over here. And if you do understand the risks, you just tick this little box right here and click play. If you're enjoying the video so far, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more content like this, and then let's get back to the tutorial. So here we are. It says Minecraft Java Edition 20.1 right here, slash fabric modded. And that is because if you go to options and video settings, it will look totally different. That's because we've installed Sodium and Iris all at once. And what you want to do is go over to shader packs right here. So that's options, video settings, shader packs, and then open shader pack folder and now drag in complementary shaders just like that. There we go. Now don't unzip it, just leave it as a .zip file. Close this and as you can see, it's just appeared in Minecraft. So what you wanna do is click it just like that, click apply and click done. Now if you click done again and done again and open up a world, you will see that you have successfully installed complementary shaders. So there you have it. That's how you install complementary shaders for 1.20.1. Before I leave you, I wanna show you one little trick. Go to options, video settings, shader packs, click complementary shaders and click shader pack settings. What you wanna do if you are struggling to run this shader is go over to this profile button right here, click it a few times until it says potato and then click apply. And then you can also disable the PBR using the RP support button to basic PBR disabled and then click apply again. And now you can close this menu. So if you now come back into Minecraft, you can see it looks a little more basic, but it definitely still looks like beautiful complimentary shaders. And I get a lot of comments from you guys telling me, you know, it, the installation worked, but I can't use this shader. I can't run it. I don't get enough FPS. And this is a way to fix that. Just set it to potato, disable RP support, and you with that potato PC right there. I see you. I see you. You can also run this shader. I hope you enjoyed the video. That is how you install complimentary shaders for Minecraft 1.20.1. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know down below in the comments if you have any questions, or you can join our Discord where there will be a lot of people that can help you answer the questions about shaders, about Minecraft, about mods, about anything Minecraft related pretty much and then last but not least i will of course catch you in the next video see ya